Hi guys, welcome to Luna's Life. Today I'm going to do a video about gerbil treats. This was actually requested by one of my subscribers, so thank you very much for that and big thumbs up to you. If there are any other topics that you want me to discuss, please put them in the comments below and I'll make sure that I do that as quickly as I can. Gerbil treats is slightly different to the treats that you would have seen me offer in other videos. I do offer Rice Krispies quite a lot when I am taming, training, bonding. Having said that, I do also treat my gerbils to what I call proper treats and they are your fruit and your veg and your seeds and your nuts and I would only do that maybe twice a week. That's how often I would give what I call the proper treats. Now I'm going to go through a list of, of those that I actually offer my boys and although this isn't a complete list and there's probably a lot of other things that you can give your gerbils. These are just the popular choices for my boys. Also, the reason I have quite a few different selections is because Alpha might like something that Oscar doesn't and so therefore I provide different treats for different gerbils. And you might find that with your gerbils as well, that some gerbils will prefer different treats. They might not all like the same thing. So let's get stuck into it then. The fruit that I actually dish out to my boys consists of blueberries, strawberries, apples, bananas and pears. And also be mindful when you're offering fruit that you get it as fresh as you can and you offer it straight away. And it's not fruit that's been sitting in your kitchen for a week because as fruit gets older, it ripens and that's what makes it yummy for us because it actually has naturally occurring sugars in it. And that's just due to the ripening process and the amount of sugar that the actual fruit produces the older it gets. I also offer veg. Um, peas are my boys' favourites. So I do offer peas, I offer carrots and I offer beans. I don't mean baked beans, I mean the fresh beans that you get out of the pods. All of this is fresh, none of this is frozen, none of this is pre-packed in the little boxes. It's all with the skins on and I either peel it or put it in with the skin on. It's, it's that simple, it's raw and fresh is, is the way you want to go with treats. I also give seeds but I will always portion it. I would always give them maybe like two or three sunflower seeds, two or three pumpkin seeds, a ball of one of the sprays of millet. Nuts, they're actually really, really great in the packet, but I do like to have shelled nuts and I like to crack them open so that I know that they're getting the freshest nut that they can get. And please don't buy or give them any nuts that have got salt on them, dry roasted, anything with any kind of coating on it. Just give them the plain, boring nuts. They love them. And I give them hazelnuts, cashews, peanuts and walnuts. There are other things you can give them. So peanut butter, um, toast, but I tend not to. I tend to stay away from those as much as possible and maybe once in a blue moon they may get a corner of my toast and once in a blue moon they may get a piece of peanut butter. Now that's the list of fresh fruit, veg, seeds and nuts that I give my boys. Obviously there are other alternatives that you can use. Whatever works best for your gerbils, but know that your gerbils have their own personality. And so if you want to try any of these, by all means give it a go. These are foods that you're going to eat yourself anyway, so you wouldn't have any waste. I normally make sure that I treat them at the same time on the same day every week and stick to a schedule and a routine because all animals love that and gerbils in particular like that. Okay guys, so I've got the blueberry, I've put it into thirds and I'm just about to offer it to the boys. Now they are huddled and sleepy, so hopefully they will wake up enough to be able to take this from me. Oh, I've just dropped it in their bedding. What's this? And that's alpha. And that's echo. And let's see if Oscar wants a bit of blueberry as well. 
all three like blueberries. And all three are happy, munching away, and they love it. And that's it, that's the only treat that they will have until Saturday, and then I will choose maybe a pea from the vegetables, or I might even go with some seeds. <laughs> they try to eat each other's. Echo's already finished his. He's being greedy, trying to get some of Oscar's, but they love it, absolutely love it. So they're all wide awake now, bright-eyed and bushy-tailed. And they're all wanting a little bit more. Was that good, boys? You enjoyed some blueberry? Yeah, you enjoyed the blueberry? Yummy, yummy, yummy. As you can see, Alpha and Echo left the skin of theirs and they just ate the flesh, whereas Oscar likes to eat the whole thing. Well, that's it. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.